up behind my son and shot him for no reason. All right, time now, 4.30. Well, the family of a man shot by Jackson police officers are calling for justice after a new video has investigators taking a fresh look at the case. Hello again, I'm Walt Grayson. That shooting case is three years old, and it involves two Jackson police officers who were initially ruled to be acting in self-defense. But now, new videos come to light, and today, the family of the man who was, who was shot is speaking out. Our 12 News' Tao Ta talked with them a little earlier today. Tao, what would you find out? Well, while Devon Montecure's mother says she's fortunate that her son can still walk. Now, he was shot three times by two former Jackson police officers in October 2017. His three children, ages two, six, and nine, tell me they want their dad to come home. Now, just a day after we heard from the mayor of Jackson and the Hines County District Attorney, Montecure's mother and the family attorney, Carlos Moore, took their turn in front of the microphone. They say the new video in question of the officer-involved shooting was in the ha hands of the Hines County District Attorney for at least a year, saying there was ample opportunity to show what exactly took place in October 2017. Now, the family says while they are surprised it's taken three years for the truth to come out, they're happy the case is going to a new grand jury. It was painful to see somebody run behind my son and shot him for no reason. You know, and you know, he's, he just went through a lot behind it. He couldn't do anything for himself. Yes, ma'am, so it was very painful. Devon Montecure's mother wants to send a message loud and clear that there needs to be accountability whether or not you wear a badge. Now, attorney Carlos Moore says their investigation has located the alleged officers. He says one is at Lincoln County Sheriff's Department and the other is doing private law enforcement security work in Houston, Texas. For 12 News, I'm Tao Tao.